This video is sponsored by UnlockThatPhone.com. Unlock any phone, any carrier worldwide. Visit UnlockThatPhone.com for more information. What's up guys, Jared back. So I hope you like the new studio lighting that I recently got in. Uh, it should dramatically improve the actual video image quality itself over pretty much all the other videos I've ever done in the past. Uh, anyways, with that out of the way, uh, in this video, we're gonna go ahead and show you how to uh, side load and install the new Google Now launcher that uh, Google recently pushed to the Play Store. Um, unfortunately, if you try and download it on anything other than a Nexus or a Google Play Edition phone, uh, the installation won't actually work. In fact, you shouldn't be able to even download it. But that's okay because in the description below this video, I've actually posted a link to the actual APK file itself. It'll take you to my mega account and you should be able to download it within 30 seconds. Uh, anyways, we're going to go ahead and show you how to install that on pretty much any Android device running any ROM, custom, or stock firmware. Let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty, so once you've downloaded the file uh, that I've linked to in the description down below, what you're going to go ahead and do is, and of course I'm going to be demonstrating this on my Samsung device running, you know, TouchWiz, um, and I'm just going to be using my Patriot because that's actually where I decided to put the uh, APK file. I'm just going to go ahead and actually, there's something that we have to do before. Um, first things first, what we need to do is jump into your settings menu if you haven't already done so, and what you need to do is locate where your security settings are. So we're going to go ahead and tap on that. Uh, once we're in there, you go ahead and look for where it says unknown sources and that's what allows you to sideload um, applications so if you don't already have it checked make sure that you do check it all right so make sure that, that box is checked once you've done that um, some devices might need to do this though some uh, might not um, go ahead and jump into your Play Store go to your apps and um, search for your Google search application all right so for instance right there you're gonna search for your Google search application and if it says update then go ahead and update it. If it doesn't, then you should be able to just leave it alone. Anyways, with that said, I'm gonna go ahead and plug in my flash drive, just like that. And uh, again, you guys may have already downloaded it and pushed it to your internal storage, which is totally cool. I'm gonna be jumping into my flash drive here and I'm gonna be locating it under my miscellaneous applications and there's what your file should look like. That's what it should look like, all right? So I'm just gonna go ahead and tap on it. It'll ask me, do I want to install it? Go ahead and click on install. That'll take just a moment. And then we can go ahead and click on done. And if you click on the home button, or if even you just wanted to press on open, uh, it would open to the launcher. But I'm gonna go ahead and tap on the Google Now launcher, click on always, click on okay. And there it is. We are now running the Google Now launcher, complete with, whoops, that was a mistake, complete with Google Now, ready to go. And that's it, guys. Um, it's got, you know, just like your app drawer, uh, you know, stock Android app drawer. Um, you know, we can click on the uh, settings button, gives you access for wallpapers, widgets, and of course, settings if you want to jump into there. And, you know, of course, if we wanted to add another home screen, go ahead and drag that off to the right. We've now got two home screens like we had before. And, OK, Google now works as you can see. Anyways guys, that's it for this one. Quick little video for those of you out there that needed to know how to install it. Um, hopefully you liked this video and if you found it useful, go ahead and click that likes button down below. But if you're new to the channel, subscribe for more videos in the future. Um, but anyways, thanks for watching as always and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers guys.